so that's a lot of light. Whoa. <laughs> Good morning. Welcome to Vlogmas 2021. It's Fiber Love Diary. How are you? Today I'm going to be doing some dyeing, some baking, and then there is something else. I guess we'll just see what it is because I can't remember. <laughs> I'm up. I'm caffeinated. I'm showered. Um, I'm dressed. And last night I soaked a whole bunch of woolen fiber and I got all the baking stuff out, did an inventory, found out what I was missing, got my stuff from the store. Like, I'm so ready. The furnace is off, but I'm about to heat this kitchen up, so I'm gonna need the ventilation. And we're just gonna dye some fiber. I'm gonna put on a Christmas movie on this TV right here. We're gonna dye some fiber. We're gonna dye some blanks. We're gonna dye one hank of sock yarn for a gift. And it's not a Christmas gift. Ooh, there's a few things I need to say also. I was having a bad day when I was filming the other day and I'm sure some of you guys realize this and then a few, it makes sense that you wouldn't really think about it, but um, you are seeing this like the next day. I was having a bad day. It happens any time of year, but during this time of year, a lot of us are spread thin. We're really busy. We might be sad about things that are happening, you know, with get togethers and family or whatever. And it's okay to like take a minute and be like, oh man, this stinks. <laughs> and I was, and I was also feeling sorry for myself. One of the things I don't say enough is that if I make a mistake, I am extremely hard on myself, not with the fiber and the, and the learning. Cause in that case, I'll just tell myself, well, it's okay. Like now you know, and next time it'll be better. And I just keep working until I get perfection for me. But in parenting, being a wife, all those like relationships, if I make a mistake, I am extremely hard on myself. So that's a big part of what was going on in that moment. But you guys' comments made me feel a lot less alone. I cried like 20 times, even though I was feeling better. They were so sweet. I cried like, seriously, I probably cried one or two tears like 20 times. You were so kind, nice, appreciative. Also, it's not about Vlogmas. This has not been nearly as difficult as I thought. It's been great, so it isn't about Vlogmas. So if you're thinking, oh, she's overwhelmed doing this, I'm really not. But anyways, we need to get to this dyeing because I need to get it done. I really wanna go down to the yarn store tonight because they have spinning night and just like relax and spin for a little while. We'll see how it goes. Let's get going.
Okay, I'm gonna quickly take you through this. I only got two of the blanks dyed because I use a dollar store shower curtain liner. It's really only big enough to do two at a time. So I think I'll just grab a couple more of those. Okay, so since I'm still heating these on my stove, I'm gonna go ahead and start cookies. So anyway, I gotta bake, let's do it. So I gotta just cover this and put it in the fridge for, I mean, hours. I would say at least four hours. It's better that way. I stopped filming because I was just like trying to rush and crank all these cookies out and I screwed some up doing that so I had to redo a batch so don't do that don't make mistakes like me I'll see you all tomorrow live at 2 o'clock my time and yes there are still some cookies to go I have to do the Santa cookies still but I will take a picture for you guys if you want to see them they are delicious and I'm finally cleaning up my kitchen thank goodness I'll see you Sunday. Thanks. I love you. Bye.